Welcome again to CD Ford. Today we're going to talk about water pumps. This one here is a 33 to 36 flathead V8 water pump. As always, flatheads require two water pumps. This one here would be a driver's side, as you can note by it has a little nodule on it where the temperature sender is going to screw into. Now originally only 35.6 used that temp sender, but I mean you can always put a block off hole in there, a little plug. Next to it we have a truck pump for the same series of engines, 33 to 36. The truck pumps had a different uh, internal to them, I believe they had a bearing, and the pulleys were also a double pulley as you can see there. These are not done reproduction, this is just an old original I just wanted to show people, get an idea. Next up we have the 37 to 48 passenger, 39 to 48 Mercury, and 37 to 47 pickup, flathead V8, except for 60 horse. Now you'll notice on these pumps, this is when Ford started to use the bolt through the bottom of the uh, lower outlet there, and they can get rusty, very hard to get. A lot of people don't see that bolt and have tried to pry water pumps off. And you can also see these are when they started to use the water pump for the motor mount. Next to it, we have the uh, other rare style of truck water pump, 37 to 47 truck. And these were the ones that people used to use years ago. They do have a bearing inside of them. And what they would do is they would take the pulleys off, modify the single pulley, press it back on, and cut this down so that way it can match up with the early style pump. Now the early style pumps nowadays, the brand new ones are all bearing style, so no, no more bushing. Next to it, 48 to 52 pickup flathead V8. This one here is a passenger side. Now you'll see on the pickups for 48 to 52, they use a 5 8 belt. And they also are part of the motor mount, that's your heater fitting. On these uh, pickup water pumps though, they only used a 5 8 belt. If you have these pumps and they have the 3 8 wide belt or thin pulley belt as some people call them, your pumps have been modified. Next to it we have the 49 passenger pump. What makes it stand out as a 49 is they also used a 5 8 wide pulley, but you can also see they used a totally different mounting system for the motor mount. And they also have the, the heater fitting. Next we have the 50 to 53 passenger flathead V8. It also fits 52 to 53 Mercury. Uh, as you can see now, these are when they started to use the 3 8 wide pulley, or thin pulleys as people will call them. And the same, you know, mounting, same body is like a 49 passenger. And also, like the early style pumps, these later pumps, they have a bolt going right through there. Now the later pumps, one of the things that they did change is the block had an extra outlet or hole for the water to go through. Next we have a 5051 Mercury water pump. Now you'll notice these also used the thin belts or 3 8 wide. They had a very heavy casting on them right here for the motor mount. Now a lot of times you'll see these Mercury pumps used in uh, putting a later model engine like 49 to 53 in an early Ford chassis. Right now I'll give you a little comparison here, show you the difference between the truck and the Mercury water pump just to give you an idea of where the difference are on the motor mount idea. So one, one pump is obviously going to lower the engine in the frame, the other one is going to raise the engine in the frame. It is most common to use these pumps on the uh, fl later model flathead into the early chassis, but you'll still find some with the Mercury's. Now moving on to the six cylinders, here we have the 42 to 46 uh, passenger and pickup G series six cylinder. The distributor is on the front on these engines. You can see it's just a. This pump here is actually new old stock. It's covered in cosmoline. It is a, really nice, and occasionally we still come across them. Next up, we have an H series six cylinder. This one fits 47 48 passenger and 47 to 51 pickup. In the H series, the distributor is on the side of the engine. And you can also see the, the taller pulley on this water pump. The casting is a little different. Next to it, we have the 49 to 51 passenger six cylinder flathead. That'll be the end of the six cylinder flatheads. But you can see the big difference in the pulleys. And the casting is a little bit different, very similar. But the pulley is drastically different between pickup and then the later car. Hopefully, that'll help you identify what's in your vehicle. 
hope you have a nice day.